Hi guys, Graham here again from Bainbridge Technologies. Today I'd just like to talk to you quickly about the comparisons between AGM and lithium in their life cycles and the capacity that they hold. So just quickly with AGM batteries, it's recommended not to take them to below 50% of depth of discharge because you will start damaging the capacity uh, holding capacity um, of that battery. So therefore then, if you take it to below that 50%, every sort of amp hour that you're drawing out of that battery is killing off its opportunity to hold 100% again. So the recommendation say for a 100 amp hour lithium battery means that you can take it between 80 to 100% depth of discharge. So effectively, if you looked at an AGM 100 amp hour battery, usable power, 50 amp hour at 50% depth of discharge. If you looked at a 100 amp hour lithium battery, you've got between that 80 to 100%. So you've got basically 80 to 100 amp hours of battery charge out of a 100 amp hour battery. So it's nearly doubles. It's, it's, it's really around about 80 to 90% um, capacity on a lithium. So it's about double what you would get out of an AGM. So when you actually look at the cost involved, you should be looking at doubling the price of your AGM compared to a one lithium battery of the same capacity, because that's given give you roughly around about the same sort of capacity. And therefore then, like I've mentioned earlier, um, weight then becomes an issue. So the main advantages of the lithium battery is the fact that it will dis depth the discharge is a lot, lot more around that 80 to 90% safely. And you can go down to 100 without uh, damaging the battery, but we recommend that 80 to 90 odd percent would be the range that you would need to take it. Need any more further information, please click on the link.